Hold citizen. A moment of your time please. Great. Everything is colorful again and now I'm being questioned by another costume imbecile. I now officially hate my life. Are you happy? No, actually. That's kind of how I'd expect a supervillain to react to me, though. Are you aware that you are currently wearing your underpants on the outside of your jumpsuit? These are not my undies, citizen. My mistake. Do you know who I am? I do not, but I'm going to assume that you do. I'm also going to assume you have something to do with coffee unless otherwise stated. Naturally, I am Java Girl. And you are Lin, are you not? Seeing as how you know my name, I'm sure you wish to speak to me in particular about something. Correct, Lin. Last night, one of our operatives, the Broccoli Man, captured the infamous Dr. Ho Rebel almost entirely without a fight. Good for him. He spoke as if it were all you're doing. In fact, he credited it as only being possible because of you. I'm sure that he is just being modest. The Broccoli Man is not modest. That is more or less believable. Apparently, whatever you said to Dr. Ho Rebel completely stripped her will to fight. She was taken into custody without incident. Perhaps you could be so kind as to get to the point, as I have no interest in the superhero news of the day. As you wish. I'd like you to come with me. We could use somebody with your abilities in our supergroup. I have no interest in playing superhero, nor do I have any desire to follow a badly dressed figment of my imagination. What? At this point I have eliminated all but the possibility that I'm in a coma. Wait. You don't think I'm real? Perhaps in whatever world you live in, so-called superheroes and supervillains are real. But where I come from, it's all just a fantasy. I had never heard of an actual superhero existing before yesterday. Seriously? Have you considered that you might be from another dimension? I have given it some thought, but I find the entire concept a bit far-fetched. It's not far-fetched from where I'm standing. Can you think of anything different lately that might support the theory? Now that you mention it, I find it is much more colorful than I'm used to whenever I encounter a situation such as this. Literally? Yes, literally more colorful. There is a way we can test this theory, you know. How about this? You come with me to my supergroup's base and we use the equipment there to see where you are from and how you got here. And hopefully how to get me back, and how to prevent this from happening, right? I can't make any promises, but there's a chance. In this case, I suppose the logical form of action would be to accompany you. Great! You won't regret it. I regret everything, 